They are not just old students of St. Monica's College, Kaba, but concerned mothers worried by the current state of the school. In their times, the college was ranked among the best in the state. It's a different story today, with the college crumbling under the weight of infrastructural decay, moral decadence among others. Who say up to the period and even some years after we left the college in 1981, there was still a lot, a lot of discipline. And the values that we all uh, garnered from the school still remain with most of us. The Smogger Conference is part of efforts by the old girls to salvage the problem. The chaplain of the college, Reverend Father Donatius Ogunleye, gave a presentation on the theme of the conference, revamping and repositioning the college for God and country. He said the present state of the school is a far cry from the vision of the founding fathers and called on stakeholders to act now. So it requires the participation of the old students largely. And I want to use this opportunity to call on the very many old students out there who are not available to make their support and contribution to the growth of the college. They should never forget that the college as it is gave them the opportunity to become who they are today. So they should always remember that as they have become resource persons for humanity, for the country, for the world today, the younger generations that are following them need people like them to be able to grow, develop, and become great and even bigger and greater persons in the world. Because the motto of the college principally is for God and a country. Home President of Smoga, Esther Medubi, said plans are underway to make the school better. For some months now, we have actually been working. You know, because the situation of the infrastructure was not quite uh, encouraging at a point. But different sets and different people have been coming together to renovate uh, many of the structures, provide some things that are no longer available, and uh, we, we intend to keep working. Mothers who have children, and I believe that we will come together, work together, pray together, so that the lives of these students will have a meaning in future. Since they are putting on this uniform, they are ours. So we have to sit tight and make sure that we build the school and build the children for the betterment of the whole country. This school, as the principal of the school, I told myself that I want to leave this school better than how I met it. St. Monica's College was established in 1964 and has produced over 10,000 old girls. Jonathan Majali, NTA News.